In this video, you will learn how to use the Trios Design Studio copy tool. Trios Design Studio is a complete digital workflow with fully integrated CAD CAM modules. This solution is dedicated to dental practices that would like to keep production of restorations like crowns, inlay onlays, veneers, and bridges in house. The copy tool option can be found in the Anatomy Design step. This tool allows you to copy the anatomy of an existing symmetrical or contralateral tooth or anatomy of another design. You can also copy a tooth from a pre-preparation scan. Firstly, let's look at copying a contralateral tooth. Simply click the copy button. You will be prompted to click on the occlusal surface of the tooth that you wish to copy. Move the black arrow over the contralateral tooth and click. This will create a line around the tooth that was selected, and what is inside this line is going to be copied. You may wish to adjust the line a little. This can be done either by clicking next to it or dragging on the tooth. The software will create a preview of the tooth that can be copied. After any adjustments have been made, click the green arrow to copy the tooth. You can then proceed to use the other anatomy design tools to adjust contact points and occlusion if needed before moving on to the CAM module. For example, you can go to Automatic Tools and click Auto Design to create a valid design of the copied tooth. You can also copy or mirror your design from another design. That option can be used, for example, when you work on two incisors. Once the design of one is ready, you can mirror it to another one. To do that, first choose the tooth on which you would like to copy your design. In our case, it is tooth number eight, and click on the Copy tool. Now you will be prompted to click on the occlusal surface of the tooth that you wish to copy. It is tooth number nine in our case. Move the black arrow over the incisal edge and click it. Once you do that, the design will be copied immediately. To select the tooth that you wish to copy to, click on the tooth or choose it in the tooth selector. You can also change this by dragging the arrow between the teeth. As we mentioned earlier, it is also possible to copy a tooth from a pre-preparation scan. This workflow involves taking a digital impression of the pre-preparation tooth. To do this, select the pre-preparation icon whilst on the case setup page. An extra pre-preparation scan step will be added to the workflow. While designing the restoration at the anatomy design step, there are two ways to copy the tooth from the pre-preparation scan. When a pre-preparation scan has been added, a new slider is shown on the right of the screen. When this slider is used, you can fade in and fade out the pre-preparation tooth. When there is no color on the scan, then the pre-preparation is shown in blue. In order to copy the tooth, slide the active item slider all the way to the left and slide the pre-preparation slider to the right. This should reveal the underlying pre-preparation tooth. You can now select the Copy Tool option and place the black arrow over the tooth as before. You also may have to adjust the area of the tooth that you wish to copy. When ready, click the green arrow to copy. Use sliders to change the visibility and use the design tools to perform adjustments. There is a second way to copy a tooth from a pre-preparation scan. If a pre-preparation scan has been added to the order, then an extra button called Morph to Pre-Preparation is shown in the automatic tools. Simply click the green play button and the tooth will automatically copy the anatomy from the pre-preparation. You can then proceed to use the other anatomy design tools if needed before moving on to the CAM module. Now you have learned how to use the Trios Practice Lab copy tool options. Thank you for watching.